I, I remember shooting the pilot and then it just sort of turned into something. But yeah, but I, I didn't know where it was going. And I'm not I'm not really sure they knew what what they were. Do- I kind of floated around with different storylines. I heard, you know, I heard different things in the works. Um, but I'm not, you know, I, I, I'm not sure they knew what they were doing with, with Aunt Nell. So. Did, did you feel like you had what John Glover and Annette O'Toole would say, Lex and Martha, I'm sorry, Lyle and Martha, what's called the golden handcuffs. You have this opportunity to be a part of the show. It takes off and it's great, but you're sort of like tied to it and you can't make any other plans because you don't know when they're going to use you. And when they call, you have to show up. Or did you, were they a little more like receptive? receptive to like the fact that you might be doing other things or flexible. I I don't know. Flexible. Yeah. Yeah. They, they were, they were flexible. I, I was, I think at the time I was doing three or four shows at the same time. Wow. So yeah. So, so I, I was, I was really lucky. Um, I had, I had, um, a show with uh, Chris Carter going and then a Canadian show going and, um, all the ADs were, I mean, it, it, I'm making myself sound to be like, you know, but, but it was kind of cool. They were all working each other's schedules out to, to try to fit me in. Um, and then, and then it, and then it just, then it just sort of left. <laughs> and and uh, I think I came back for the wedding at some point. 